Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make coconut oil from scratch. Welcome to Sun Hill Boy. Hey guys, for those of you that didn't find me through my wife's show, she had this show right here. I want you to know that sometimes she gonna be on my show and sometimes she gonna be not ready for me. The first thing that Joe is doing is opening the coconuts. And if you notice, he's using coconuts with a brown shell because this is the type that you need to make milk or coconut oil, okay? Now, the coconut has somewhat of a face, and if you poke at the hole that looks more like the mouth, you can actually pour the water out, but you don't want to drink this water because it's kind of icky. It also has a vein, and if you take a hammer or the back part of the machete, you can also get it open. So that can be a little bit more safer than what Joe was doing with kind of chopping it with the um, business end of the machete, okay? But Joe's a pro, so that's what he does. So see, they're opened. He bought seven coconuts, but only five was good. Two of them was kind of rancid, so he decided not to use those. So he is carefully taking the coconut from the shell, and some people have suggested in the past that you can heat it up to get it out more easily, but this is the way Joe knows how to do it, so he does it very carefully, and he dumps the pieces in this bowl. I'm using the Blendtec to go ahead and grate the coconut. As you can see, I already have some in here. So let's get started on the other one. And I'm gonna pour the water just above the coconut. That's good. And then, and then I go put it on pulse to chop it up. I'm so glad that I have this Blendtec so I don't have to grate my fingers. If you notice, I have to put water in the blender so you don't burn the motor out. But it's okay because I got to put water on the flakes to squeeze it anyway to get the milk. Look at this little blender go. Now it's time for us to dump the rest of this in the bowl and let's get squeezing. I'm squeezing out the milk so I got to uh, put water in the coconut, uh, in the grate of the coconut and squeeze it. So we we'll squeeze out the milk, out the flakes and squeeze it out and squeeze it dry. We're going to get ready now to skim the milk from off the top of the water. So let's get started. What I do it the last time somebody asks if the water is good. No, the water is not good. Just throw the water away. People who watch my wife show um, say that this is not virgin coconut oil because we gotta cook it on the stove. But any, any way you look at it, you gotta cook it if it's even um, cold press because you gotta heat it up. You gotta go through a heat till you get the oil. So it's virgin coconut oil. I'm using a skimmer to get the cream from off the top of the water, but don't leave this more than overnight because it's gonna get rancid on you. I'm cooking the cream down until it forms oil. So what I just gotta keep on stirring it and uh, so just put the fire uh, medium and just let it down let it start cooking pretty soon it's gonna cook right down and gonna cook right down until it starts to get brown then the oil gonna stay on the top. So here is my oil coming. So pretty soon it's gonna be brown and the oil gonna be on the top. See, so it's starting to get brown now. See all the oil coming on the top. We're almost there. Just get a little burn, a little burn a little bit more and we're good to go. See the time guys, it takes about a half an hour. So I just gotta let it cool down now before I pour it out. So let's get ready to pour out the oil. I'm using a strainer to pour the oil out off the Maya. If you notice the oil is coming out and you could see the oil. So I'm going to use the spoon to squeeze every little drops out so I don't want to leave none behind. So look at it. Let's strain the oil yet again and check out how much we got. Only three quarter of a cup. I wish I got more for all the hard work I did. But I'm going to pour it in this plastic bottle and store it 
and we're going to do something fun with it. There you have it, homemade coconut oil. If you guys remember when I was squeezing the milk out the flakes, that's the coconut milk, which is this right here. And when I set it overnight, that's the coconut cream. You can always cook with that also. But I want to do something fun and different with it. So I make the coconut oil. See, it's this coconut oil right here. And so in upcoming videos and stuff that I'm going to do, we're going to do something fun with the coconut oil. So I hope you guys like my channel. And if you guys like my channel, please put a thumbs up. And subscribe and until I see you guys again. Take care. They call me Quick Fix Joe. So what I did. But if you take a look at this one, it's on. Finally fish. Look at this place though. Right back, you know.